Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Zeros on the Road. Um, I received an email last night, or an email response last night, from an inquiry that I made to a group over in Sweden called QEG Sweden. Now, I know, I know, QEG, but anyway, <clears throat> these guys ordered a Kesh MagGrav uh, device and they are testing it. I was looking at the videos that they published, uh, or at least posted on their web server, and uh, was very impressed with their methodology in testing the Kesh MagGrav unit. As far as I can tell, they are following the conditioning process precisely to the letter so that they don't invalidate the warranty that is so easy to invalidate from the Kesh Foundation on these MagGrav devices. Um, they're doing really nice work on this and they have given me, exclu not exclusive, but they have given me full rights to republish the videos that they put up on their web server because they are not publishing on YouTube. So this may very well be an exclusive, not sure. I don't know if anybody else has asked for permission, but without any further ado, I would like you to see what they are doing to test the Cache MagGrav device. Hello, all Cache lovers, and welcome. This is uh, January 7, 2016 <clears throat> and today I had the delivery of the power mega from Kesha so it's with the manual and some tool to find a live plug and <coughs> uh, I guess it's I, I ta it Italian style contact so that's the first thing I had to change probably because that will not fit in the Swedish standard but that's no big problem. So my plan is I'll probably uh, connect this one on my test site tomorrow January 8 and then I'll keep on reporting how it will go with the setup because I'm going to try to follow exactly by the manual. See you later. Okay, now it's on. Okay, greetings all. Cash lovers, <laughs> uh, this is uh, January Sunday 10, is it? Is it? Yes, it's 10. <laughs> and we are going to start up testing of this PAV unit from Cash Foundation. So the, the thing we will do, we have this one here. And can you zoom in to Yes, to I that will zoom on this one. I'm so sorry. So. Like. Can you see it or? No, no coating checker. Yeah, so that, that's what uh, we've done just to see if it's going to, we can see some normal coating going on on the bare cables there. Anyway, this one I will connect to the socket in the wall and then we'll connect Oops. Okay. this one here input to the power unit 
and then output we will connect here shit I you added wrong it has to be oriented of course so the live yes. terminal has to match the live side so we were lucky I haven't connected it in the wall that's so far but anyway that's the way it should be connected I take a zoom on the wall connector also now Oh, yeah, 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 we will do, do that later because it's kind of hidden. So. Yeah. Uh, so we'll just end this session for now. You can make it pause now. Yeah, we start with it. Yeah, we just think about it. Yeah, we can start with it. Okay. Okay, so this is the first time we are going to connect the power unit now. <coughs> so this cable is from the wall outlet and we have made sure to, we know which terminal is the live one. And then we're going to connect this meter so, so we can meet number of wattage or things that yes. goes into the system. Because yes. This is the connection now to that ramp and from that ramp we are going into the power unit. So let's connect now see what happens. So let me zoom in. Yes. I see something there. Can you see now? Yes, it's zero something. Yeah. Because, let's see. Can, Can you see? see? Yeah, not yet. Uh, f wrong focus. Uh, why it's wrong focus there? Now it's focusing. 231 volt. Yeah, that's voltage. Volt. And next one should be ampere is zero. Yes. Hopefully, next one should be number of watts. Or zero also. It should just be zero. And then three others kilowatt hours and stuff. But anyway, everything yes. is zero now. Yes. So now it's initiated. And now we have started the first day, and it's gonna stay like this for three days without any load at all. So we'll come back with another report after three days. Perfect. Thank you. Ja, har, har du bra fokus på den? Ja, det är jättebra fokus. Okej, ja, okay. okay, uh, greetings. Uh, so this is uh, uh, January 13, Wednesday. And uh, we are preparing for uh, connection of the first load on the Magra power unit. But uh, just to convince ourselves, uh, what you see now, it, it is uh, we have connected to one uh, <coughs> wall outlet where we have the test, where, where we are doing the testing, and, uh, in, and that wall has its own fuse and. Uh, then we are comparing this to uh, our second wallet that we are convinced ourselves that that is on another phase. So we have three phases in, in the house wiring but at the moment we are just going to do the testing on one of the phases. Okay, so look at your post there. So. so now we are checking the coating here on the three cables. Let's doesn't seem to be so much. And there's the second one. Hey, brother, yeah? Yes. Oh, it's too much zoom. Now I see. Okay, now I shut down. Well, oh. no. 
Okay, so now uh, as a beginning of uh, this testing, we will just measure. Uh, we have two uh, lamps that we are going to connect now. Uh, each one is, I think it's going to be six watts load. So we can check it here. The first lamp, the blue lamp, is here, and we have the 220. 230. Ah, this is the voltage, this is the amperage, and this is the watt. 6 watts. Is it 6? Yeah, okay. Then I pause and take the other lamp. Yeah. Now it's recording. Okay, so this is the second load, uh, also a LED lamp, uh, and is it uh, any in the LED? Yes, 9. Oh. Okay, so this is 9 watt. So we are going to connect one lamp 9 watt and one lamp is 6 watt. I'm going to break that one. Is it working? Yes. Okay, so now we can see the status of the watt meter here since we connected three days ago. So this is just the voltage. And of course no zero ampere. Zero watt. This is the max watt. And this is the watt hours. Okay, so we can see of course as expect, ex expected, we haven't really done any consum consummation of any power at all. That's what's to be expected. So if we go back to voltage here. Du kan kan inte du koppla in dem nu då? Så så kan vi se att vatten ökar här. Okay, this is the current wattage, and now we're going to connect uh, the first lamp for 6 watt. Oh, the roller for trying, right? Yes. Uh, now we connect so the first lamp here. Yeah. Now, the first lamp is connected. Ah, no, no, no. This was the, the, the lamp that is 9 watts, right? Yes. Now we take the other one. And it started uh, consume, consuming here 11 watt, and now it's down to. Oh! Now we connected the second lamp, that was 6 watt. So the sum of these two lamps now should be 15 watts. 16. So it's no, but the nominal sum is 6 plus 9, so it should be 15, right? Yeah. And now we can see it's at the moment the input 16. here is 16 watts. But they are approximately anyway. Okay. And uh, that's what's to be expected, I guess. Yes. So uh, we'll leave it at this and then we'll come back next time when we are going to change the load and we're going to report on the result of this loading we have put on now. I, I will zoom out so if you. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> so you see the. Oh, oh that's right. Bra. Bra. Oh, so uh, you can zoom in on yeah, there. Both. Coupling, I guess. Now we see the lamps here. All connect. So now we come back in a few days.